Here's what you missed on Fathead and Candy in the morning, weekdays 6 to 10 a.m. on My Country 96.1. My Country 96.1 Fathead, Candy Roth. It's Thursday. Another week has uh, flown by here, Candy. How was your day? It was gorgeous. Mm -hmm. Absolutely beautiful. We're at the park with Tilly. Had a great time. And uh, my love for hot and sour soup has gotten ridiculous. So that's what I had for dinner last night that we ordered from um, a Chinese uh, restaurant here that has very good food. And now I'm like addicted to it. What is hot and sour soup? It has a bunch of vegetables. It's got a little kick to it, a lot of heat, a little heat to it, a bit sweet. And it's got tofu. It's delicious. It's my new favorite thing. I can't stop. You know what bothers me? I noticed Brian used to cook a lot more. You've been ordering in quite a bit, have you not? Well, he did eggplant <laughs> parmesan. Oh, that was amazing! He still cooks. Very nice. I but love I'm eggplant. On this, I'm on this. He made it so good. This could be mm. his new specialty. I'm telling you. All uh, right. But I'm on this new hot sour kick. I, I can't take it. I can't get enough. <laughs> you gonna order again tonight? Is that what's I have happening? Another bowl waiting for me when I get off the air today. I ordered a quart. Very nice. Look at you ordering well, ahead. I'm, re- I'm really. I don't know what has come into me. It's just. Everything I ever wanted. (laughs) How quick do they get it to you, Candy? Very quick. Very quick. Very nice. I'm excited for you. This is big news in your world. Uh, A new addiction to add to the list. I mean, outside of you taking a road trip with your friend to Florida during a pandemic, this might be the most exciting thing that's happened to you, Candy. It's a new addiction, I have to say. I think about it all the time. Yeah, this is uh, this is wonderful. And Tilly is uh, doing well with her heat? Yes, her blood work came back. She's doing well. She weighs 13 pounds now. Everything looks good. And she'll, uh, as soon as she's two weeks out of heat, she's still in it, by the way. Yeah. Um, then she'll go for her spade. So okay. We'll, we have a little uh, meetup appointment in three weeks. All right, that's that's good. I we- love my new vet. He called, the nurse called, they sent this extensive email with all the blood work. They're the best. That's nice. It's nice to have any type of doctor, regardless of the specialty, uh, take the time and the effort, right, Candy? I agree. I agree. And I'm so much happier than when we first went, which was just not good at all. Yeah. Oh, well, that's good. I'm glad you're, uh, yeah. you know, I feel the same way. We have, uh, we've had a couple of good vets. We, you know, we used to go to this vet that was like 25 minutes from the house out in uh, Quag, and they were great. They took care of all our dogs for, you know, a long time, over a decade. But then we uh, found the great vet that's right here in our town, and not only do they take great care of our uh, Lucy and Millie, but they also board, and they have a great boarding uh you know, area. So right. it works. It it's works. Important. Yeah. Uh, yesterday, uh, big breaking news in Elijah's uh, class. Somebody was uh, tested. Uh, a kid was tested positive for the virus candy. That's it. So now this is not uh, new. He had this situation earlier in the school year where someone tested positive and his whole class had to sit out at home for two weeks in quarantine. Well, is we that have what the, they're doing now? The same situation. We have a kid who tested positive, and now he will be home for a couple of weeks, kid. Oh, aren't you lucky? Uh, yeah. Well, he's you excited. Are so lucky. I bet he is. He's excited. Yeah. So I'll tell you a funny story is, and, and really, there was no harm in this. It just, it, it, I'm not blaming uh, anyone. It was just very funny when I got the call. So I was going to pick up uh, Leah at the middle school and it's about 120 and she gets out of middle school about 130 or so okay so i'm okay. sitting outside the school and my phone rings and it's the elementary school and i pick it up and they say uh yes uh fathead uh hey hi how mr. are you fathead how are you M- mr fathead um we were just wondering, are you uh, coming to uh, pick up your son today? <laughs> and I'm like, what What do you mean? Am I cu- Yeah, I'll, I'll be there at the normal time when they get out at 2.30 or, or whatever. Um, uh, no, uh, you should have re- received a call earlier uh, that uh, his class, uh, someone tested positive uh, very early in the morning. We got a result back, and the class was sent home early this morning. Did nobody call you? And I said, nobody called me. 
Okay. With Elijah. So it turns out he was in his classroom with the teacher, just him and the teacher. He did all his homework. He ate his lunch. He had his snacks. Hey, this <laughs> is what to do. Right. So I said, thank you for providing a full day of daycare for my child. I appreciate Lovely. it. Lovely. I never got the call. And then, you know, listen, I did my due diligence. I went back and I checked my cell phone, my house phone, Dana's phone. We didn't get any call. So it is what it is. No harm was done. A little oversight, yes. Right. Yeah, <laughs> that, look, look, this is what to do. Keep him with the teacher. Everything gets done. So he was the only kid left, but that was fine. He got his homework done. He got everything. You know, it was I great. I love it. I love it. I thought of him yesterday. I uh, prepared a little fruit salad sort of on the, mm. on the spot. I wasn't planning to, but I had a few different things. I said, let me cut it up and put it in a container. <laughs> and I went out on the deck, and I was munching on that. And I said, you know that kid, Elijah? He's got it right. This is really good. He loves his fruit and veggies. It's unbelievable. You don't have I'm to force this you, kid. Yeah. I saw, I, I made myself, I said, you know what? He's got it right. It's really <laughs> good and refreshing. Thank you for thinking of him. Appreciate yes, that. Yes, I do. I think uh, every day. And then today we have a busy day. Leah has a uh, road tennis match at a uh, another school. So Oh, an away match. Yeah, she's got an away game. So I'll be driving today. I'm driving about 45 minutes to get to this game oh, today. Oh, it so, is far. Wow. Yeah. So uh, we'll uh, we'll have a good time by country, 96.1. Fathead and Candy in the morning, weekdays, 6 to 10 a.m. on My Country, 96.1.